Ladies, I have to say these vision boards are just really beautiful. And I love that you took the time to go through everything that I know bothers you in your mind about what I haven't been able to yeah. wear and what I haven't been able to try and putting that together in these boards. It's really helpful for me because I want to make you feel as beautiful as you are. And Aww, I want awesome. you to be able to Thank wear you. those things that you feel like, oh, I can't do that or I can't try this, but you can. You really, right. really can. And I want to show you how we can do that and make you just feel that one special moment where you're like, I earned this, I got that moment. Wow. So awesome. That's I'm great. I'm so excited. Yay. So, Brandy, on your board, I mean, I really, yes. I mean, the women that you've encapsulated, I mean, on top of the, the dresses, obviously, because I know dresses are a struggle for you. you. You, in your mind, feel like maybe your figure and your curves that you shouldn't accentuate them or maybe you shouldn't right. show them off because we all have these issues in our minds where we feel like, oh, maybe it's too much or maybe, you know, I right. shouldn't show that. But, you know, you have an incredible body and you're working harder to make it even more beautiful. And Thank the you. women that you've chosen have beautiful voluptuous figures as well. Yes. So I think that's important to note. I mean, you know, a lot of people look at Goldie Hawn or, or other celebrities, um, right. you know, like Oprah even, but their their bust lines are really dramatic and the way in which they wear them are, are really unique. Oprah is always about, you know, encapsulating her bust and showing a little bit, you know, so it shows off her waist. Right. Because she has struggled over the years with weight loss and weight gain um, and trying to always maintain that same sense of proportion. She shows off that waistline. And I think right. that would be the same with you, where, you know, you feel like, oh, I've been up, I've been down. What can I do to make sure that I always feel like I'm in that same right. kind find of level playing field? Right. right. It's always knowing where to find your waist. Right. And, and that's going to be important. But I really think that the, the bust line and the waistline encapsulation and then also understanding a good length for your body. Right. You're so young and so fresh that if you can, you know, sort of imagine a shorter length, like above the knee, mid thigh, I think that's really going to open you up to a whole other world of possibilities and the dresses that you can wear. Right. And make sure that, you know, you're, you're feeling young and sexy. Right. Um, okay. I, I, I love the long gowns and I think we should definitely. Yeah, I think I realize like mostly. <laughs> Everything is long. Right. But <laughs> and Rochelle knows I have something about that. But um, <laughs> but going back like to the look with Oprah, just the rouging right. and like you said, just the way, you know, I just think it's like sensual and like really pretty. Um, I've always had this thing like off the shoulder, mm. like just, you know, the draping. Absolutely. Um, stuff like that and then eventually like something you know like with the little crop top showing the a stomach a little revealing. bit yeah you've yeah. earned it we want to show it off a little yeah. bit yeah <laughs> show those six pack off yeah so um and then of course other gowns you know just going out and well, we have to have that yeah. one fun red carpet moment yeah i mean when you work hard like that you want to show it off and have that moment to shine right absolutely no i absolutely love that and the ruching is great so the ruching covers all manner of sin so to speak so even for people that are remarkably thin like that dress is really what people are looking for because right. you'd be surprised at how many women have body issues. The average size for American women is a 14 to a 16 W. Really? Yeah. It's okay. an absolutely phenomenal reality right. for American women now that, you know, what used to be a standard eight has now really gone up to a 14 and a 16. And wow. there's there's nothing wrong with that. I, I, I'm all about it personally because I love curves. So yes, in my right. dresses, it gives it shape. And, you know, and I know people are healthy. You know, right. It's like I know people are eating, they're fit. taking care of themselves. Yeah. You know, yeah. it's like I don't have to worry about am I designing a dress for someone who's not, you know, not eating properly or that might have a dietary issue. Right. Um, you know, it makes me feel good to know that that's going on. And all of those kinds of pleats and shirring and ruching, right. you know, they give women confidence. So you're right. As you can see, like mostly everything on my board is long because right. um, I have this thing about my legs, which Rochelle knows. And I keep telling her, <laughs> you need to show those legs. Well, I'm going to get some scissors and we're going to cut these pant legs yes. in, a little, in a little bit. Good job. Definitely. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so other than that, and I'm all about the ruching, the yeah. off the shoulder, you know, that yeah. type of thing. No, so. I mean, you, you've definitely got a good sense of what you know will work for your body type. I think it's just elevating it to the level where we can show off more of your body so that you feel more confident. And I promise you, the more that you experiment and play with that, the more confidence you're going to get. Because once you hit the streets and everyone is talking about how beautiful you look, you're going to own that moment. Right. But exactly. until you do it, <laughs> gonna be working until it. you do it, you know, you're not going to feel that sense of accomplishment because yes. you can do all that work. And if you hide it under layers and layers of clothing, no one's ever going to say that to you because they're going to feel like, oh, she's, Ex she's not showing who she is. She's not expressing right, it. Right. You tell her, Richard. I've been telling her this the whole time. Oh, we're going to go long. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be a long day. <laughs> okay, cool.